I'm opening the debate with you. I'm opening the debate with you. I think, I think somewhere, somewhere, if you look at the response to this film, it's almost unreal. It's almost like it was waiting to happen, but it didn't happen so far. Which is the bigger issue? That a film like this was not made in the past? Or that finally a film like this is being made? As many years as I've been in the film industry writing, uh, Can't hear. I've yet to see a film. Can you hear me? Can yeah, I can Amanda? now. Can we just improve the audio? Yeah, thank okay. you. I can, I can, I can. Okay. Please. Okay. In the many years that, you know, I've been writing for films, I've yet to see a film elicit this kind of a response. It's visceral. It's passionate. It's a truth telling. It's an opening of the floodgates of emotions and suffering that has been buried and, and concealed and suppressed under political speak under political correctness. And I think films are not supposed to make you comfortable, especially films like these. They're a reflection of what happened, what is the truth of thousands of people. And you cannot expect that to be comfortable and come neatly packaged and tied with a ribbon around it. No, it's going to be raw. It's going to be real. It's going to be painful. And sometimes you have to experience that pain to truly understand the suffering of people who live amongst us and yet carry on as normal. So I think it's a very compelling film. It's a film that's going to be remembered for a very, very long time to come. It's a film that's going to give courage to other writers, directors, people in the industry to start telling the stories that need to be told and haven't been told so far.